instead of uh, reacting based on your emotions, you have to choose your reaction based on three important uh, components. A, who are you talking to? Is it a family member? Is it your boss? Is it your co-worker or your friend? Or maybe it's your neighbor. So what is your status in this specific situation? With friends, we're equal, right? With your boss, you have a lower status. Your boss is higher. With family members, it can be different. With kids, you should be responsible, um, a responsible adult. With your grandparents, you should show them your respect. And with strangers in a supermarket, you don't have to explain yourself, but you should be respectful. So uh, number one, based your reaction on who are you talking to? Who are you talking to? Who is this person? Number two, B, what result do you want to achieve in this specific situation? Do you want to keep your job? Do you want to keep your friendship or your marriage? So what result do you want to achieve? And number three, C, A, B, C, evaluate the situation. Is it the first time that this person is being rude to you? Or has he done this many times before? Is it his regular behavior or is, his, is this a new situation for everyone? Is this person specifically offending you or is he just being emotional about the situation and his words and actions are not being addressed specifically towards you? So this is three very important uh, components to remember. So how can you choose uh, your reaction in a stressful situation. Think about three things. A, who are you talking to? B, what results do you want to achieve? And C, evaluate the situation. Is it the first time or this person has done it many times before? Okay, let's continue. Step number seven, ability to communicate. This is Ability to discuss different opinion without creating drama or conflicts. Ability to accept that uh, the other person, even uh, your best friend, your soulmate or your child has the right to have a, an opposite opinion from yours. Ability to respect an opposite opinion of yours. Ability to listen. Ability not to interrupt trying to prove that he is wrong and you are right. So ability to communicate and discuss different opinions. So uh, please look at those seven, seven points that we have already discussed and write in chat or in comment section. If you're going to watch it, this video later, Please write uh, the corresponding number of the sign that you were able to identify in your friends, in your family members, or perhaps, perhaps even in yourself. This is a time when you can reflect on yourself and admit where you need to work on yourself and where you can grow. If you want to be successful in life, if you want to create love and caring and meaningful relationships in your life, then uh, try to be open-minded and um, try to see your own imperfections. So try to put your defense mechanism uh, aside and um, your emotions aside just for a minute and look at those seven points that we have already discussed and think about them, where you can grow. So please write a number in chat.